Welcome to the Biography Channel. Today we will be talking about Mary Claire King and how she helped our world. On February 27, 1946, Mary Claire King was born in suburb Chicago. At an early age, she found a love for mysteries and solving mathematical puzzles. Sadly, at the age of 15, she lost her best friend to cancer. She graduated from Carleton College at the age of 19 with a mathematics degree. She then pursued a PhD in genetics at Berkeley University. Soon after that, she left her studies on campus to take activist work. This work was on the effects of pesticides on farm workers. When King was offered a job, she reached out to her old professor, Wilson, for advice. He encouraged her to come back to the lab because he saw potential in her. They ended up revolutionizing evolutionary biology with proof of humans and chimpanzees sharing 99% genetic material. They also found common ancestors more recently than believed. After, she began analyzing the patterns of breast cancer in families. She thought it might be inherited in some cases. King wanted to find the gene responsible for the inherited breast cancer. In 1990, King and her colleagues discovered the first gene associated with hereditary breast cancer. This gene is BRCA1. To this day, she maintains youthful interest in combining science and politics. At 73, she is currently the American Cancer Society Research Professor in the Department of Medicine and Genetics at University of Washington. She has received many awards over the years, one of them being the Brinker Award from the Komen Foundation. In 1993, she was given Woman of the Year in Glamour magazine. Fun facts about Mary Claire King. She discovered that as many as 10% of breast cancers are hereditary. She received a National Medal of Science from President Obama in 2016. She was recently given the Dan David Prize, which is a $1 million award. Before King's research, not much was known about diseases like schizophrenia. People were having trouble finding a genetic explanation until 2008 when King and her colleagues found that it's due to a mutation in the genetic code. Her research on schizophrenia has transformed the understanding of complex disease inheritance. Her brother's name is Paul King. She has a daughter named Emily King Caldwell. King has done many amazing things over the years and continues to amaze people. The lights are low. Looking up for a place to go. Thank you for joining our program today, and I hope to see you next week.